We were all expecting Spider-Man No Way Home to be big, but I don't think anyone was expecting it was going to be the second biggest opening weekend of all time at the box office in the middle of a pandemic. <laughs> yeah, the third solo film featuring Tom Holland in the role grossed $260 million in North America. It topped Avengers Infinity War to take that runner-up spot. It was still behind Avengers Endgame, which is understandable. But for it to make $260 million is unbelievable. And Tom agrees, writing on Instagram, Wow, guys, I can't believe these numbers. You made this possible. Your love and support means the world to me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And if you haven't seen Spider-Man No Way Home yet, Merry Christmas and you know what to do. Dwayne Johnson, who will star in his own Marvel movie fairly soon, in Black Adam, commented, I'm so effing happy about this. Congrats to you and the entire Spider-Man team. I see that emoji, Dwayne. Enjoy this massive and historic win, brother. Simu Liu, who also delivered some record-breaking numbers in his own Marvel movie this year, and Shang-Chi, The Legend of Ten Rings, wrote, Yeah, buddy. Congrats on a smash opening. Or I guess it's ye, buddy? I don't know. You can decide which one it's supposed to be. Now, if you're wondering, how does Tom stay so down-to-earth with all this extraordinary success? <laughs> his dad's comment on the box office numbers post was, when is this film out? <laughs> I love it. <laughs> but yeah, Tom also shared some of the craziness that happened at the premiere of the film. We're here at the Spider-Man premiere. I can't believe it. This is crazy. I'm like, just breathe, then you'll be fine. So this is a video. This is a video. <laughs> yeah, on opening day, Tom also shared some photos from that premiere with his co-stars like Marissa Tomei, Benedict Cumberbatch, and his real-life girlfriend Zendaya writing, I can't believe we actually did it. Sharing the screen and my life with these incredible people has been nothing short of life-changing. This movie is a labor of love and celebrates three generations of cinema. It truly is a dream come true. I'm forever grateful for all the love and support we've received over the years. We love you and thank you from the bottom of our hearts. Enjoy the movie. P.S. Bring tissues. Uh, I haven't seen this movie yet, but I'm going to cry at this movie. I have to cry at No Time to Die, Avengers Endgame. Oh, it's a lot of crying going on in these action movies lately. But yeah, I guess people haven't been spoiling No Way Home yet, so don't spoil it in the comments for other people. But yeah, what do you think of those crazy Spider-Man numbers this weekend?